This is the Tumblr. This is the Light Cycle. In real life, neither one of them exists. We make the shit that lives in people's imaginations. We take their imaginations and we bring them to life. If you can imagine it, we can make it real. Because this shit right here is real. Now, two brothers reach into the world of fantasy and make real life rides that'll blow your mind. I'm Shannon Parker. And I'm Mark, the good looking one. We are the Parker Brothers. I'm the chief designer at Parker Brothers Concepts. Building has always been my passion. I do the welding, the fabrication, the engineering. I'm the older of the two brothers. He's the bigger one. Their passion for extreme machines started with a childhood obsession for comic books. Batman, Spider-Man, Avengers, Superman, X-Men, oh, Silver Surfer. I could pretty much go on forever, but I'll stop. We just sold a vehicle for a half million dollars and we've got another one in the works for a million five. And they said reading comic books would never amount to anything. Suck it! The things that we build, the machines that we create, give guys more wet dreams than Jessica Alba. And that's my number one, so that's saying a hell of a lot. We used to do construction, and then we decided to get off the road and find something that we could do here locally, here in Melbourne, Florida. The business came about accidentally. Now we're building vehicles for movie stars, movie studios, and things like that. Every episode, the Parker Brothers take on a new challenge. I'm looking to get a bike built for a music video. Name a movie, Battleship. I want you guys to build a shredder. I want this thing to scream John Cena. Let's get it started in here. Every part that we build is a custom made piece. We never get full payment for any of our vehicles up front, so we always put our own money into these things to finish them before we can get paid. We don't have time for a backup plan. There's no directions to follow. There's no rules, no blueprint, and we don't have any room for error. I think Jay-Z said it best. We got 99 problems, but a bitch ain't one. The engine is still not working. Oh my God. It's supposed to be right here. At this point, what do we need to do to start fixing this thing? Cut it all out, move it, blend it in. We're either cutting the whole front fender out and moving it back, or we're moving the whole body back. What is it, a half a degree off or something? I mean, give me a f***ing break. The best and the worst thing about my job is dealing with my brother. Talk to me like that again, I'm gonna kick you in your ass. Yeah, I guess there are probably some arguments. It's because we both really give a damn about what we're building. We want the customer to be happy, and we want the bills paid. I got it single mothers to take care of. But they don't do it alone. I feel terrible now as to what my mother had to put up with. Came home one day, there was a bat symbol on my car. <laughs> it absolutely drove me crazy. I'm Shannon's wife, Karen, and sometimes his mother. I started working at the shop basically because if I didn't, I would never see my husband. Murder! You see why I don't get smart with her? We have the coolest group of guys in the world here. They're like my brothers. We have fun, we fight, we argue. If it wasn't for those two, I'd be in jail or homeless. We take what we do here very seriously. We just don't take each other very seriously. I'm Donnie, I'm Jack of all trades. Vin Diesel, stunt double, male model. You are not get the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's like working with a bunch of cartoon characters around here. My turn. This is the island of misfit toys. Anybody that works here, works here because they won't fit in anywhere else. Just a normal day here at Parker Brothers. We don't really advertise what we do. The clients usually come to us. Jeff, you can see it's here. Good to meet you. They'll sit down with Shannon. They'll kind of come up with some ideas. We'll tweak the designs. I try not to hold Shannon back when it comes to his designs. It's really easy to dream big when you don't understand physics. But sometimes I have to rein him in a little bit because things still have to work. On the shredder, we couldn't see out of it. So we put cameras here, so inside you'll have a way to actually see. If you're going down the highway at 100 miles an hour, you don't want to be looking by camera. You That's kind of want to see what. Speed Man, I need new tires and a clean pair of shorts. <laughs> we don't have crash test dummies here. We have to test these things ourselves. Have you seen those commercials with the crash test dummy? Yes, yeah, see, I'm the dummy. And I'm the one that gets torn up, but I can take it because these guys are pussies. Hold on. What are you doing? Damn it. 
The reality is, if we made one mistake, somebody could lose their life. Oh, it's very dangerous. The way these things are going together, it's all experimental. It's kind of scary, but that's the fun of it. You can't make an omelet without breaking a couple of eggs. If the client's not happy with the vehicle and they want us to make changes, that's coming out of our pocket. We can't afford that. Every one of our builds is usually a referral from another client. And if we've got a client that's not happy, the next job is gone. I am worried every single day of my life that this could be our last job. It's kind of a nail biter like every single time. What the what guy would not want to build futuristic car for a living? We don't have a business plan. We have fun. If you can dream it, let's just see if it's possible. They can build it. They are the Parker Brothers.